Yo, what up, everybody? It's your boy Stewie the Gamer, and today we are back with some more Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Last time we just kind of explored some, we did a small little quest where we went and got the hammer for Hafton um, and returned it to him, and that's about it. And then we did some exploring, did some mysteries, did some looting, all that, and we came back to the settlement, um, upgraded one of our farms, or two of our farms. We got one completely done, um, I believe the cattle farm. And then we got the grain farm upgraded some. Um, realized we have a fowl farm that we need to build. We haven't started on yet. Um, as well as we just <laughs> happened upon a new quest line. Or new quest or whatever from Sigurd. So that's what we're going to start today. But before we get started into that, if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Ring that bell so you get notified whenever I upload new videos, which is multiple times every single day. And leave a like and comment down below. Let me know what you thought. And let's get into it. Um, actually, before we do that, I haven't cleared all this stuff out after I played last time. Um, so let's go and do this. One eighteen. That's oh, two-handed. I believe I can dual wield two hands. Let's go ahead and upgrade that. So yeah, All right. So I can hold that in one hand. Let's go ahead and add some ruins. Flanking. Okay, back damage. Attack. Speed. Elite damage. Hmm. I don't know what elite damage is, but it sounds cool. Attack. Critical chance. Oh wait, let's see. Look to that elite. Whatever that was at. No. Your skills, we got seven, so let's let it randomly do it. What is this? We're in the end game now, reach power 280. Oh, yeah. I knew we was getting close to beating it, but it's got a fucking achievement letting us know that we're, <laughs> we're getting close to beating it. Oh, we got the upgraded version of that. Kicked enemies will remain down and at your mercy. Hell yeah. Alright. Now let's go ahead and go talk to Sigurd. I wonder if he knows that me and uh, Randvi hooked up. Eivor, the time has come. Our time. Our time for what? To fight? My final glory awaits. Your final glory? I fear to ask what that means. Do I not speak plainly? Nope. My time in Midgard is done. I wish now to see the hall of my ancestors. If you wish to die, it will not be by my hand. I do not speak of death, Eivor. I speak of life. Life and glory everlasting. I know I've been in a fog these last few weeks. Mm -hmm. I know I speak words you don't fully understand. But I only ask you trust me once more. On my final voyage back to Norway. To wish my father farewell. And achieve my destiny. So we'll back come back to, to Norway. Norway? I need to discuss this with Ranvi. If you must. I will await your answer down by the docks. Do not keep me waiting. Well, you will wait as long as I tell you to wait, dude. My love. Your husband just walked by. Don't fucking be calling me my love. I want to see the alliance map. Oh wait, we got no way down here. All right, that's cool. I know. Uh, I watch Mad Max's channel, which it's linked down below if y'all want to go check him out. Um, he got a little thing kind of like this, but I believe it was on this side. It was, uh, Vinland, which I don't know is actually 
proper pronunciation and spelling of Finland or not. Um, but yeah, Vinland with a V. And it was over on this side. But then we got this, which is like Norway's map. I like how it kind of sticks up there. That's cool. I knew I was going to go back to Norway whenever I went exploring. It may be time to return to Norway. But I'll go explore there maybe. Before I come back. I don't know. I have heard ill news about Styrbjorn in the past year. If you go, go with care. Okay. I don't know. I might not explore now. Kind of my usual routine. We will leave now and return as soon as we're able. Good. And be safe. Both of you. There. Last time I had a fucking letter. I thought, unless that bottom one was just leaving. I don't know. But I thought. You tell me I had two letters, and one of them let me get an axe, which I have on me. And then I never got to look at the other one, or what I thought was another one. I might not have had it, I don't know. Yeah. Alright, let's go. So good. Shall we then, Eivor, to Norway, and well beyond? Sure. To Norway, then. Good, good. Lead on. No. In the Hall of the Slain. Let's see here. Go ahead and get that off. Let's see where we're at exactly. We're way up here. Like how this is the section that we've seen on the table in the top part was even invisible, or the bottom part, which was the top of the thing, and how the orientation was different. That's cool. I like that. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of stuff over here that we haven't picked up yet. So at some point, I will go back and explore all that probably not today's episode but yeah let's uh keep going i got those fucking photos i hate that shit all right has changed but it feels unfamiliar a few years abroad have shaped us more than all the decades we spent here brother it's bloody cold Older than I remember. Because yeah, we haven't been in the fucking cold in forever. We went up north of England, but not really much. We need an epic tale. I don't think there's any raids for us to do in Norway. I won't half the camp with my wailing. This is Harold's fair hair's kingdom now. Every peak and fjord. It pains me to say it. To think it even. And our father, his fool, the poor man. It is a role he chose. He bent easily and broke in half. Do not pity him. No. For many moons I could not sleep, always thinking of his betrayal. Horrors I wished upon him. He deserves nothing but shame now. Put it out of your mind, Sigurd. There's no need to hound the old man. No. He must taste the same foulness that I taste. He must know what glory he missed by staying here, the lap dog of a conqueror. You want to speak with him? Yes. Face to face. I will tell him the truth. Okay. So we going fight Were you at the good part yet? His father? I knew that one dude, Harold or whatever, I think what his name was. I knew he seemed shady at the beginning when he was talking about we could be an alliance like under him. He'd be like the true king and 
Whatever. No second? No. How about how there's gonna be peace? So you can't fucking make other people be peaceful. Are you sure of this? You can try, but it ain't gonna work. No sense. No such thing. I crave it. It may be the old hound has lost his bark. But maybe you will light a fire beneath him. Inspire him with tales of our glory. Come on. If I do, I'll stoke that fire until it burns. I need your eyes, my friend. Okay. For around that drinking area. Oh, there's something. No, you need to worry about what Randy said. Randy's not here. A little drunk. We should go. Look at him. Father. Odin's blessing, come and let me look at you Stop. both. That is far enough. Blood of cheer. What happened there? A grievous wound you have. Are you well? Far better than I look, I assure you. This, this calls for a toast. Your journey must have been long and cold. A drink to warm your blood. We are not here to drink or make merry. Only to look upon the rackets of a once great man. And then what? Make new war against King Harald? Stake mm -hmm. a claim on his crown? Is that your wish? To sow more chaos here? Sure. You're absurd, old man. What could possibly interest me in this frozen backwater? Interest you. You robbed me of my wealth when you left for England. I presume you would do it again. Not my idea. You left us with nothing when you pledged for King Harald. We took only what we deserved. <laughs> I have returned for one reason only. To say goodbye. And to thank you for your colossal failure. Failure? As a father, as a king, as a man. For without it... I would not have discovered my true self. My failure, as you call it. My oath to King Harald was the only sensible path forward for a man in my situation. And what have you done with yourself since? Drink heavily and weep for what might have been? I have... I have worked hard to broker peace across our land. To spread Harald's message of unity. I heard you sleep beneath Harold's bed, always at his back and call, and that he uses your gaping mouth as a chamber pot. You make light <laughs> of my service to a great and powerful man. Is that how you treat those who serve you, Sigurd? You pathetic worm! Sigurd, this is not why we came. Plans change. As do hearts. Not this one. And you, Eivor? You should have told us of your plan to bend the knee to Harald. And spared me the shame of seeing my father debase himself like a gutted pig. You are right. I owed you the truth, and for that I am sorry. But I will not apologize for what I did. Then I have nothing left to say to you. My son, please. Mm. 
You've spoken your words, and Sigurd has heard them. What happened to my son? What turmoil did he see that took his arm and darkened his mood? He saw his father for what he truly was. A coward who faced his enemies with more honesty than he did his family. I was a father to you, Eivor. I have no father. Hmm? This sad business is finished. And good riddance. Now we sail for further shores. To my true purpose. To my destiny. To the end of my road. I will follow you as far as you wish in this world, brother. But if you mean to take us further, I may reconsider. <laughs> I do not think you will, Abel. I think you will marvel at what I have to show you. <laughs> Get a feeling we're going to have to fight him and kill him. Still dwelling on your father? Not at all. I was only reflecting on my visions, <laughs> wondering at them, how present they are, like memories of yesterday. Describe them for me, your visions. My earliest was of a large door. Embedded in ice, far north of Hurdafir. The saga stone embedded at the top of its arch. As the visions grew stronger, the door opened, revealing many things. The life tree Yggdrasil, the golden fields of Valhalla, and the faces of our gods, all of whom called me friend, brother, warrior. I felt at home among them, warmed by their love. You should know, you are not alone in this. I too have had visions. Have you? And what did they foretell? It is hard to say. I've seen Odin leading me into shadows. I've seen spinners weaving wild destinies from pools of blood. I saw the great beast Benny, the branches of the world tree, and a man with one arm. Go on. Valka warned me of the great betrayal. But what form it takes, I cannot say. I see. I hold to my oath, Sigurd. You know that. Betrayal is not in my nature. Of course. Not. Except when you banged his wife. Stalwart as a pillar of stone. Come now. My destiny awaits. Okay. Let's get out of here. Where are we headed now? Let's see. Nothing around. Let the sail out. The door is wide here. Less our passage. Yes. I feel a great calm as we cross these waves. This ordeal with the elf king, Alfred. How far have you pushed him? Does he bend? Will he break? Guthrum's army will be chasing him across Wessex now. With luck, he will push Alfred into the sea. Strange how these earthly concerns seem so distant to me. But we've gained so much in England, and we stand to win even more. The Christians are hardy foes. They see one man above who holds the axe. One man higher than us all. That is a powerful few. We hold our own axe. We swing it where we may. The woman, Fulke. In my time with her, as painful as it was, she showed me things. Things so strange and wonderful, I am almost grateful for her treachery. What she did to you was cruel beyond measure. Yet, with every snap of the blade, with every scar, the loss of my arm, my visions grew stronger. If you can find the good in that, fine. But she was as mad as the ocean is wide. Even the mad ones can offer whiskey. Their Jesus was an odd fellow. Now half the known world loves him. And no one believed us when we were young, and we chiseled our plans onto tables in mean halls. Not even my father. There is the Sigurd I know well. 
Can we not return to England and finish together what we began? No, forget all that. The future is forward. A great wealth awaits us. I'm with you, brother. Until the end. Okay. Still got quite a ways to go. I wish this would go faster. It's a polar bear. It's probably like an animal fight. Of course. Well, that tells me it can't be fucking reach, I don't know. Now it looks like we're going faster than what we was. Okay, go through that little narrow opening, I don't know, it looks like we came over here. Oh well. Holy shit. That well. Whatever it is, it's fucking big. What's the guy that's doing here? Menu not available. What's the menu not available? What the hell? Yeah, fuck this. Let's having us fucking turn around and shit. And I was just go straight now. Follow me into this kingdom of 
snow! Sigurd, can we not wait for this to pass? Ah, oh, the sting of ice and skin! Revel in this, Eivor! We walk the footpath of the gods! To where? More glaciers and deserts of snow! To glory! Could we not wait until this tempest quiets down? With a ship, where we have mead and food to warm us! No! We must confront the omens and honor the gods! They will not seek or find you! We must go to them! We would be poor company, with frozen bones and ice pellet for eyes! You need not fear the cold, Eivor! Where we are going, the winds and snows cannot touch! Uh -huh. cold as wind from Nibelheim. Keep steady. It should not be far now. <laughs> mm -hmm. We're slowly getting to wherever, I guess. I don't know why it wouldn't show me the map where I go. Maybe not available. I don't know. This where we walked in the vision. I don't know. Can't remember. Remember there was a mountain clip though. There. That frozen lake. This must be it. And ahead lies a cavern. Will you not say where this leads? Ah, you will see soon enough. I'm too late to turn back, I fear. There! The cave! Mm -hmm. Within hides the sacred gate. There's one up there to loot some shit. The ice looks Hold up. Can you yeah, it's there. You happy? Well, let's go. Let's be following you. Where have you gone? That looks pretty cool. Gungnir, is it you? What? Was I supposed to come this way? Some type of fucking Isu looking spear thing. Is that our weapon now? Before. 
Space above. The Saga Stone sat there, did it not? Long, long ago, yes. Now stand clear. Svachoi nogvat uns membro trurvon divorde uns solas vras gnogadide unsum hukas reis derae hasaunsi. How did you do this? Where did you learn these words? I told you, Eivor. My visions are memories of a life once lived. Come. Gods. What is this place? Um, okay. Okay. Is he gonna die? I don't know what to say. This is all so strange. Trust this place, Eivor. This old and sacred place. Where does it lead? To the Hall of the Slain, the Golden Fields. To Valhalla. Um, okay. This vessel was it drafted by dwarves? It is finely made. That much is true. I doubt Gunnar could hammer a piece ten finer. In this cavern, so deep and humming with magic. Hmm. In fact, it's not even going to see how deep it is. The old tree, the tree of what? life. What is this? See how proudly she sits, how beautiful she gleams. Here, all the roots of life run together. The skulls would cry to behold such a sight. And there is more to come. I swear by all the names of the old father, this is only a taste of what I have in store for you. For my visions go further. Can't um, even control the camera. So look around or anything. Okay, here we go. Now slide me. Huh. Ava, where have you gone? There. Do you feel that? The sacred energies. I have never seen something so grand. This shrine is ours. It will open for us. Watch and see for yourself. How do you know these things? Was all this in your vision? All this and more. Mm-hmm. I'm coming. I was just looking that way, dude. Calm down. See if anything popped up. This does not look like a fucking. What the fuck is this? What the fuck? Who's that? Um. This? I haven't seen this in any of the games yet. But this kind of looks like the uh, things from the movie Assassin's Creed. Um, the Animus type ordeal that they put the dude in. Um, it's more like this. It's pretty cool. I don't know what the fuck it is, but it's what it kind of looks like. I'm coming, dude. Curious who that dude that's dead up yes, there is. This ancient shrine is set alight by the sphere of metal. And these shining arms, these branches, they will grant us access to the refuse of the gods, to Valhalla. Are you ready?
What lies beyond all this? Where does this lead? Take your place at the center there, and you will see. Um. Okay. It just lit up. It's not letting me run or anything. The fuck? Um. The fuck is going on? Hill, you give us the guest is coming. Oh shit. I'll be back in England. That's my bed. This doesn't look like the long house. Where the fuck Where's are we? Place? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Huh. I know the loading screen was white, which is usually what it is when we travel to Asgard or Yoltenheim, I believe so the place. Oh wow. So is this Valhalla? The Javi, yeah, so they're seeing us as Javi. So is this us and Valhalla? That great battle at the end of time, Teleporto? Tyr said you would come. Welcome. Are you. Are you Valka's mother? Swala? You have a keen eye, Wolfkist. After all this time, Eivor, we have arrived. Now raise a horn with Freya here and sing a victory song. Sigurd. What is all this? Your, your arm has returned. Oh. And your vicar as well. Glory eternal, Eivor. Here okay. we dine in the great hall of the so... state. Long last. Oh, I want to scream with joy. This is... Okay. This is all so beautiful. I knew all the gods were certain the people. Were... They were real. The battle has closed! Come so... Freya is actually um, Valka's mother. Go, Evo. Enjoy the fight. You have earned your place here. I was thinking it might have been Ranvi at first. But it's not. Alright. Some of these people call me Eivor, some of them's been calling me Javi. Oh, we got this fucking spear type thing. Oh shit, that's cool. Oh wait, we can just kill anybody and everybody. Alright. Even if they're fighting each other. Oh hell yeah. Should explore earlier and got this fucking thing. Batteries are about to die. That's not. Don't be a coward, eh? Sigurd, this place is incredible. Enough with those short flies. You and I must fight the battle we never had and hold nothing back. For here we need not fear a thing. All right. All right, let me pause it here so I can go get me some batteries. I don't want my controller dying right before 
or during a battle. But first, let's equip some of these. Increase attack after each hit up to 10 times. Mm. Heavy crit, cool hits, knock enemies on the ground. Parry has a chance to create a small fire around you. Ignite your weapon after critical hits. Stealth headshot creates a sleep cloud. Alright, that's cool. Ooh, let's go to runs. That's And now I will go and get me some batteries. All right, let's get back to this. At last, I share the thin of infinite battle. The true oh wow, this is this thing is fucking OP. Oh, did we just cut his arm off again? Scars here, only battle wisdom. Okay. What just happened? Are we going to be repeating the same thing over and over now? Let's see. See if it's the same thing again. Yeah. What the hell? Lead us to glory, Harvey. Yeah. We are proud to serve you, Harvey. Wet my lips with another horn of mead, brother. Strength for strength. Okay. Sigurd, it's just your arm has grown back. It was never gone, Eivor. Not truly. Nothing is permanent here. I told you, nothing save the courage and reputation of its warriors. Are we immortal in this place? <laughs> Let us discover that together. A new day. Uh huh. So the exact same thing. So we're gonna go and fight Sigurd on that rock thing again. I don't even bother fighting everybody else. So they're fighting each other. We fought them over on the truck, I think. Wait, what are you doing now? Just chilling here? Faith to the morrow's bed. Again, you've lost your arm. And again, it will Okay. It's not exactly the same. Oh, is that you? All right. I'm curious who else we're going to see here. Quite something. That's for sure. Raise your horn, Eivor. 
What stops you? My father, Varim. Have you seen him in this hall? I have not. Should he be here? No, he died a coward. Yet by Odin's eye, I swear I've seen him. Hmm. Cast aside your cares in Malhalla. Let seeking go. We have earned our joy. The journey is complete. Way up there. We are proud What's that? You, Great warriors. Have you seen Varen? Who? Varen. Varen? Father? Oh, I think it's fixed camera. There's Sigurd again. Oh. Ha. Next time I lose this fucking arm, I'll beat a man to death with it. Do you not tire of his injuries? There he is. Wait. And I'm gonna wake up again. Nope. Not him. Oh shit. In the ah, uh, yep. Cause of Odin. he gave curious Eivor you have a guest you should have knocked first nonsense I brought you someone Luke my Eivor, there you are. What a warrior you have made of yourself. I am overfilled with pride. How did you find your way here? You remember our great battle. You remember how we fought side by side with your mother and Sigurd and our clans united. We fought, father, but you did not. You died a coward. Eivor, enjoy this. Your father has returned. Oh, shit. Have you lost all your love for life? That was not my father. That was a lie. That was not a lie. That was my gift to you. I have power here, and I can do as I please. You wish to see your father. I made it happen. As easy as breathing. By Odin's laws, my father is not allowed in this place. I do not wish to see him where he should not be. Your father died doing what he hoped would save you. He died to protect you and his clan. No. He... This is the end of our road, Eivor. This is Valhalla, the eternal golden field. Now come. Battle beckons. Mm-hmm. How is all this possible?
How were the slain brought here? The Valkyries know this. Only them. No. That cannot be true. None of this feels right. Do not despair, Eivor. Look. Your friends are here. Everyone you could ever want is here beside you. Mm -hmm. No. They are not real. This place can be whatever you wish it to be, Eivor. I do not want it. Not like this. You would resign yourself to an empty death? The ecstasy I feel here is an illusion. I would sooner call like a raven than sing a false song. Illusion or not, here there is no death, no pain, no loss, no betrayal. Not like out there. You want this? ...to live inside a lie. I am an old woman with a broken body. What life I had left was brief. So I bid farewell to my dear Volka... ...and came here. Mm hmm I wish you well, Swan. So that was probably her, I guess. On the other thing earlier. I'm trying to figure out who that was. So yeah, it's like their version of Animus. I'm not there in just this fake augmented reality of Valhalla. Return to England with me. Our people need us. No, I am no one in that world. I am somebody here. Powerful, capable, a god. Here I may live forever. Here I cannot die. Family die, you must die. The only thing that never dies is the reputation of the one who's died. In here, you have no reputation, but out there, it's not too late. Every day, the same empty war, the same hollow victory, spilling blood that tastes of water and smells of grass. You have known real battle, real glory. This is not it. You know this. I know you do. Brother, it is time to leave. Am I destined to follow you everywhere? To the end of my life? All right. We go. No, you stay. I do not give you leave to go. What the... Why leave this place? A glory you fought so hard to find. Why is... Why does he look different? He's got different hair and... Beard. the same your reputation is close or anything forever. the hell 
you are the wolf kissed one who lingered at the edge of death yet fought back. Mm -hmm. And your point? You spilled the raven wine of battle to paint whole kingdoms red. Is that spear he's holding? That one that I had? Just with the Isu stuff? You have killed kings and crowned them as you desired, bowing to none. Okay. You stood tall where your brother stumbled, yet still you came to his aid. Great foes in your brief time. Hmm. You have earned your place here, Eivor. Seize it. Stand aside. My people need me. I have given you everything you wanted, everything you needed. You gave me nothing. It was all me. Yet I cleared your path. I guided your axe. You were a fly buzzing in my ear. How dare you deny me? Oh, shit. Everything you believe in stirs before you. Yet you question all. You question the very gods. I have to fight you with the fucking axe. Do not diminish yourself. Your cause hall is nothing. So I have to fight my own fucking thing. But a dream. A dream is as real as anything in this world. Do dreams not inspire? Do dreams not make us fear? Came fucking using my abilities. Then I am done with dreaming. Do I just have to fucking sail off? I mean, my health's going down, but he has no health. Do I have to die here? Is that what's supposed to happen? I have no rations. I can't use any of my abilities. I can't even pull out my arrow. I look like what I was deflecting. I was still... Blood. Popping up. I don't know. I don't guess I'm supposed to die. I don't really want to test a theory, but I think that's what's probably going to happen. Maybe not. I'll find out, I guess. That's what was supposed to happen. Stand. <clears throat> okay. Keep dying. Ah, kill me, dude. I don't really want to just stand still away from killing me, so I'll still swing. I'm not going to deflect anything since it looks like I'm supposed to die, I guess. Unless I'm supposed to be killing over here. Is that what I'm supposed to be doing? Oh, no, he's not going to let me. Alright, fuck you dude. Uh. 
Okay, so he has control over my axe. So let's unequip it. Sigurd, are you... are you with me? Sigurd! Ah, the Hanged One awakes. The Hit fuck? the ground once more. Eivor, be careful! Lassim, what is this? Come closer, Eivor. Let me get a better look at you. Leave him be, Lassim. For too long I stared at the sun. It blinded me to the truth. That it was you. It was you I wanted all along. Did you track us here? Like a cowardly fox concealed in the brush. You widowed my destiny, Wolfkist. You broke all my hopes. He's mad, Eivor. Silence him. Come, Eivor. Come save your crippled prince of dead races. Oh. Are you hurt? It is nothing. Go. Kill that background. You must suffer a thousand times what I suffered. What is this about? My son, Eivor. This is about my son. You speak none, Assassin. Who the fuck is your son? I have figured out um, that Basim is low key. Is I don't know, so Avi or Odin or whatever. Fighting. Oh shit. Into the um, low key son. Been here. Oh shit. Oh god. What the fuck I want to do? Speak your grievance. Show yourself. I do not wish to fight with you. <laughs> Don't. Am I supposed to die here too? I don't know what some of them front. Shit. Find out, I guess.
dude. Yeah, I'm actually made me fucking heal here. I didn't use the fucking rations. Cause I only had four. I was about to die, and they gave me full health. So maybe I'm supposed to attack him. He doesn't have a health bar or anything. So I don't know. Where is he? There he is. Ah. You are. Yeah. Show me. <laughs> the kiss of a wolf takes my prize. Oh, of course. Yeah. Yeah, I suppose I noticed my health went up a little bit right there at the end. It was actually going to heal me this go around for some reason. The others were killing me before I got right at the end. If you are assigned to this, so be it. You will not die in peace. You will never see I'll try it right here. See. Cool. Kill me.
That one can't die. You need to suffer. Yeah, I'm like. Well, yeah, and I hit him and fucking. When I have finished, you will be a sack of blood and shattered bones. And my conscience will be clear. Interesting. We'll drag Sigurd into the fray. The fuck? Coward! Face me! Fight me here! I like how it's given us some of those things. I guess just in case I did use up all my rations, thinking that would save me on the other. I got a feeling the next fight, since they're giving us all this, will be one that I could die in. There's a bunch down here. Oh yeah, for sure. <clears throat> Oathbreaker, you die here. This brings me no joy, Justice Bringer. You were always so kind, but you chose the wrong side. <gasps> I am your prize, Basim. Come. You are indeed. Pretty quick. One hit. Oh. Fuck you, dude. That's pretty easy. See it. Stop this thing. Now's its fire. See good. planning this treachery I, dare I wonder who Bassam's son actually is Gods. No. Loki son was Finnier kind of like the re embodiment of him you have something you want to say then say it so I wonder if there is actually I need some time to breathe someone in the story that we've killed was Bassam's son that man's anger his rage. It had a familiar sting that I... I cannot place. He was raving, Sigurd. Without sense or reason. Paid no mind. I am not mad, Eivor. These things I see and feel... I know they are true. I know, brother. Now more than ever... You always spoke true. We should cast our eyes towards home. It is a long journey and I am not well. Home. Eivor, on our journey here, I had much time to think. On the ecstasies and the agonies of our friendship. I cannot return to England with you. That is not my home. Not now. What are you saying? I know about you and Anvi. My lovers tryst in spite of me. I should challenge you for such a betrayal. But I'm... I'm not fit for such a fight. I, uh... I understand. The 
Is that all? When Dag called you out as you felt he must, you refused him honor, did you not? A cowardly act. One oh shit, all this stuff's coming back. Dag acted out of love for this clan. That is not worth the shame you inflicted on his name. I saw things differently then. <laughs> Do you recall the day we stood before Edwin, searching for the Sacker Stone? You struck Basin. You lashed out at me. You made a fool of us all. That is not a leader I wish to follow into death and glory. You were being secretive then. Foolish, I thought. And when I returned to the settlement, your pattern of disobedience continued. I made a judgment. <laughs> And you openly defied me. I believed you were wrong then. I still do. My grievances go back further still. You stole my father's riches. My haste to leave, I should have stopped you then. A true leader would have stopped that thought before it took form. You were selfish. This is not a decision I make lightly, Eivor. You are family. You were my drink. Here, our paths must diverge. No. I understand your anger. I would be too if I had suffered these insults. But there's no need to abandon what you have worked so hard to achieve. Return with me and show me how best to lead. England is too infected with ugly memories. I will stay here, in the land that gave me life and strength. Just as the prophecy warned me. Prophecy? Years ago, before we left England, I had a vision. A prophecy that I would... that foretold the course of my life up to this moment. You never told me this. Has your prophecy come to pass? I... Uh, I do not know. I, I think it has, but... Not because I chased it. Well... I hope for your sake... That you grow well into the role you've earned today. That hope is all I have left. I will try. I promise. I never thought about all those choices coming back. But if I could do it all over again, I would do the same exact thing. Fuck Dag. Bex, I'm coming out. Steady, Layla. So we're Layla again? Were you watching my feed? What the hell was all that? I think that was the solution to our problem. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Desmond. Desmond? What about him? He was just a bartender before he joined us. Not even a very good one. And that's when he learned his real purpose. He was like a... I don't know, like a singularity. You know? A vanishing point. All of human history seemed to converge on him. In 2012, the sun threw off a mass coronal ejection so large, it should have wrecked all life on Earth. I remember. I worked at Abstergo then. It was Desmond who saved us. He knew how to stop it. Abstergo claimed credit for that. Something about their satellite network. That's bullshit. It was Desmond. He pulled the switch that saved the world. But that switch is still on. Still generating a magnetic field. One that's growing stronger every day. <laughs> the temple Eivor found. That's where the field originates. Exactly. And it's been running for eight years, getting stronger and stronger. It would be dangerous now. Heat, radiation. Doesn't matter. We have to fix it. Shut it down. No, no, no. Slow it down. It's still protecting us. All of this is starting to make sense. Everything I've done. Everything I've learned, it led me here to this moment. You'll need the staff for this one. For protection. Otherwise, you won't make it past the first gate. Right, of course. Okay. I'm ready. Okay. 
I'll pack the van. And I'll contact our ship. It can be in Boston Harbor by tomorrow night. All right. Thanks, Bex. Anything here I can actually mess with. I wonder if it would let me back in the animus. for keeping it steady in there you surf this thing better than anyone i know that's not true is it well nearly be careful out there and come back in one piece thanks bex yeah. so where's that stuff we had oh let's go ahead and use the laptop <laughs> see if there's anything new here we got some more media Okay. What is this? Okay. Okay, noise. Where's that stuff? Oh. I don't feel let me back in the animus. Nope. Okay. I know it's popping up the thing, but click on it doesn't do anything. Let's go talk to this dude. I'm ready. It's a long way to Bean Town. Hop in. Sean, I'm here. Ah, good. Your signal's already a little wobbly. Are you inside? Not yet, but there's a hundred feet of ice above me. All right, we may lose touch when you push through, so remember what we talked about. Watch your meters carefully, the radiation especially, and keep the staff close. Got it. Standing by. Zawahoe Nakwat, Unsme Borturwan di Quarde, Ul Solas Bras Hunakudi De, Unzum Huraz, Vez Dere has, Zohumsi. Hotter already. Yes, by our reckoning, it's gonna go up by about 16 degrees Celsius. How does it draw so much power? Tectonics is our best theory. The movements of the Earth's crust, the churning lava beneath. Huge source of energy. That's tech humans should have. Energy, not pieces of Eden. Forget it. I'll call you when I'm topside. What are you calling when you're topside? Something like that. Here we go.
Pull it down. Steady. And there we go. A pool of water from all that melted ice. There we go. Down here. Swim up over here. Can I swim under that pool now? Oh my god, come on now. Oh, I can swim around here though. Here we go. Let's get this little waterfall over there. There we go. Will not jump over there? No. Nope. These people got some good upper body strength. Tell you what. all glitching and shit. Something feels off. Uh, hope there something feels off. It's all glitching. What is this? The fuck? Are you doing this? 
Are you pushing this machine to its limit? your master is he here <laughs> they flatter me I am only a guest in their world a world spun of wishes and hopes Basim you sent the message you led us to Eivor's grave yes a hopeful message, was it not? How? You've been trapped here for a millennium. Eivor put you here. Indeed. But I'm not alone in this place. Not always. I have a friend who helps me. Together, we read the calculations. After we located Eivor's probable resting place, I contacted you. ...through the digital lasses that enwebs this earth like a spider's nest. In our okay. day, all the world was connected like this. A superorganism of technology. The staff you carry, the temples you have visited... ...all of it speaks as one. May who's I your show friend? You something? I imagine you can do anything you want in this place. Not as much as you might think. I am tethered to my body in a most uncomfortable way. But you can slow this machine down. You know how it works. Yes. We'll do it together. For another catastrophe is near at hand. This node of time has an ugly way of correcting itself. Go ahead. I don't trust him. You're a hard man to trust. You must know that. You're not obliged to trust me. But this is all I can offer. God damn it. Silence, Odur. Verdandi. Scald. Be at ease. Your day of rest has come. At peace. At last. We last. Is that it? Is it done? Basim! Where are you? What is that? That Desmond? Layla. Hello. You know me? Yes. Through the calculations I read here in the gray. Eight years ago, the odds of your arrival were 15 trillion, 55 million, 3,276 to one. As the years passed by, those odds improved. And as of yesterday, near even. It's a pleasure to meet you at last. Who are you? And what is this? I am the reader of the calculations. All these possible futures for you and the world outside. I have spent much of my new life reading these, searching for a way to finish everything we started so long ago. It begins here. You slow down this machine and save the world, from which point all possible futures expand. Millions upon millions of possible roads. But in every one, another catastrophe recurs. The node collapses and the world is wiped out. The human race dwindles and fades. I must keep looking. I must find the solution for you. I must leave you with something. This node. This is right now where I slow down this machine? 
Yes. I start all my calculations from this point. The only thing I know for certain. That seems limited. How do you mean? What if you went back further? To 2012 when Desmond saved the world? Desmond? What if he didn't save the world? What if he walked away and let the world burn? Look at those timelines. Read them instead. I see. An interesting idea. Fascinating. Do anything with that? Exactly. These are timelines that never came to pass, but they could have. If Desmond had let the world be destroyed, maybe the humans that survived would have learned something from the disaster. And maybe in one of those timelines, they could have found a way to prevent it from happening ever again. That is brilliant. How did you come to that idea? If you spend too much time narrowing down what's possible, you may never give another thought to the improbable. Thank you for your insights, Layla. It's only the beginning. We have a lot of data to sift through. Are you staying? Until we find something useful, I will. I don't want this to happen ever again. You may not have much time, Layla. The machine is powered down, but the radiation... It will linger for decades. By my calculations, you have 73 seconds before your exposure is lethal. I'm not worried. I have the Staff of Eden. It heals and protects. No. You do not. What? How? You dropped it. Of course. Of course? Fuck. Alright. Find a solution together. However long it takes. And if that means I can never leave, so be it. I owe this to the people I, I've hurt. The people I love. Yes. I know the feeling. Let's get going, huh? A few billion timelines might take a while. It will. But it will not feel like it. That is what I like about this place. Mm hmm. Fucking pass him. You with me. I'm with you. It worked perfectly, my dear. Is the mad one here? No, my love. Only we remain. And Layla? <sighs> the air of memories fulfilled her role perfectly. She's fine, in a manner of speaking. The fuck? A manner of speaking. Jesus, we have to find her. You heard her. She doesn't want to be rescued. Bullshit. In any case, 
There's nothing left to say. Not after this long. Because of you? You left her there. This... This is all a bit much. I know... I'm in the same situation. No, no. You're in a class all your own, man. Mm-hmm. We're assassins now, not hidden ones. From the Arabic, Hashishim. Ah. And do we have a mentor? Is that still the practice? We do. Name? William Miles. William Miles. I'd like to meet William Miles. Would you bring him to me? We can call him. Encrypted line. You can talk to him right now. No technology. Face to face. A meeting of minds. It's time to take the fight to these... these Templars, as you call them. I won't go anywhere, my friends. Your animus is in good hands. Mm -hmm. How much do you know? My dear, we invented such things long, long before you did. I'll figure it out. Okay. okay. Like, what the fuck is going on here? It's a nice place to die, Eivor. Not everyone gets to choose. You bested me. I don't know how, but you did. Yet, I'm the one left standing. And now, I can take from you anything I want. Your memories, your skills, your secrets. They're all mine. And when I have them, I will put them to good use. To find my children. And bring my family back together. What? So now we play as Bassam in the real world? This is so fucking confusing. They are fucked or something. Hello, little fella. Instruments of torture, or both. <laughs> nope. Right. Let's see if he'd say something about it. Please enjoy your stay. Remember, all garbage must be packed out. And please water the plants once a day. Poor little plant. I looked like you not long ago. <laughs> Hold tight, love. A new world has opened to us. Once I get my bearings, there is nothing we cannot achieve. The bleeding effect shouldn't take long to kick in. A few days at most. So here we go. Okay. This just got very interesting. I've always enjoy the present day storyline. 
just as much as I've enjoyed the history. It's just getting pretty interesting here. Steady Avon. Go let Ramby know that we need to keep our little affair a secret anymore. I still love those face tattoos. Eivor, you've returned. Is the secret with you? No. Not for now, Zoe. Eivor, is that you? Yes. Is Sigurd not with you? He stayed behind to begin anew. Stand up. What? Stand. This seat is yours. Not the first time I've sat on it. It suits you. Eivor's returned! Inside of the hearth, come! Your secret is no longer safe. My secret? Eivor? Ranvi? What is this? Is everything alright? Our Jarl has returned to lead us forward into an uncertain future. Will you speak to your people? For love and joy, words can jade. Our souls must sound in a heartful song. And when... No. You are less mine than I am yours. And I ask of you only this. Keep me honest in the times to come. Okay. Hearken well in Hall of Kings On ocean speed my words gain wings Odin's mead I fall will bring For noble deeds thine honor sing We beat and blaze our trail of red And Odin gains upon the dead The horn resounds the mighty horn Did we just beat the game? May horns resound the mighty horn. It's kind of like feels like it's leading into the credits. No, all right. Well, that kind of seemed like those leading up to the credits. I guess not. I was supposed to say, what the fuck? And now we're drunk again, because it's fucking still Yule.
Uh, it's not even let me fucking. Okay, now we can walk. So it wasn't even let me fucking walk there for a minute. Um. Good to see you, darling. Ooh. Okay. Yes. Looking at the map here. Through my drunken gaze. We now have that final territory um, marker out there. So the next episode, we will go and do that Alliance mission. Um, so yeah, that should be fun. Um, and possibly then beat the game because this is, yeah. I'm, at first I thought it was going to end the game and I was like so confused. I was like, did we not conquer that territory or make an alliance or whatever? But now that that's there... And the credits haven't rolled. I guess that is probably going to be the final one. Probably um, fight Alfred and stuff. I'm going to assume I'm there and kind of defeat him, I'm guessing. I don't know. I'm not really sure what else we've got um, in that line. So, yeah, that's what we'll do next time, I guess. Well, that's going to be it for this episode. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Ring that bell so you get notified whenever I upload new videos, which is multiple times every single day. And leave a like and comment down below. Let me know what you thought. Until next time, peace out. Yoli, everybody love everybody.